Thank you for stopping by Ballistic Barbecue. On this video, I'm going to be doing a copycat of a Shoops burger. Let's get going. Shoops hamburgers started out in 1948 in the area of Chicago. Now they have a few locations in Chicago as well as Indiana. This is a very, very basic burger, you'll see. But the reason I was really excited about doing this is a, it's rated as one of the number one burgers in the U.S., but B, there's a very special technique involved that I haven't done yet. So another reason I love doing these copycats, I'm continuously learning technique. So let's get this show on the road. Today we're rocking the PK grill. Got the rectangular shaped ballistic grill on board. We're ready to cook. So I have here six and a half ounces of 80-20 ground round. This is where it gets a little weird. So this is the ultimate smashed burger. What I'm doing right now is kind of heating it up, heat, getting that fat to soften. Then I'm going to flip it, then we're gonna start smashing it. This thing is going to be ultra crisp, hanging off the bun. Hit this side with a little bit of salt. The burger flippers they use are, and I've always wanted to make one of these, it's a brick layers trowel, a brick throw. Cut the point off of it, and then I beveled the edge here. Makes it for a very stout flipper and really good for pressing down. So we'll go ahead and flip this. You can feel it, it's definitely adhered. There we go, nice. Have two just white buns, no sesame seeds. Get a little bit of a toast on these guys. So I'm making what they call the Mickey burger. It's got two slices of cheese. Of course, American cheese. All right, I got a nice toast on here. We're ready to build this burger now. So the burgers at Shoops come very basic. You can add on things like lettuce, tomatoes, pickles, upon request. I'm serving it the, just the most basic way. I wanna make this crispy meat the star here. So again, we're doing the Mickey. Second piece of cheese, again, American on that bottom bun. Get that nice crispy hang off the bun, patty down, looking good. Add some relish. Some chopped onions, some mustard to that top bun, top it, and there we have it, <laughs> the Shoops Mickey Burger. I have to tell you, it smells really good. I mean, that, you know, caramelizing hamburger meat is always just awesome. Let's give this a try. Huh. So I'm not surprised. The first thing that really, really stands out on this burger is that crispy, lacy, caramely meat hanging off the edge. That really heavy-handed smashing of this thing just... <laughs> really does the trick. I mean, kind of smearing it around with that trowel. Really good stuff. Toppings, I'm completely content with the minimal toppings I have hit on here again. Relish, chopped onion, mustard, cheese. I wanted that meat to be the star, and it, it certainly is the star. Bun, it's about as simple as a plain as a bun as you can get, but again, it's allowing that meat to kind of shine. And it just sounds, it's such a basic burger, but again, it's that caramelization of the meat just is crazy. It adds so many dimensions. Good stuff. Very pleased with this hamburger. I'll be using this technique again for sure. Well, I have to, I've got my trowel. Anyway, 
little note on this burger here. Again, it was a request. And whenever I get a request like this, I always make an attempt to contact the restaurant just to give them a heads up, make sure they're cool with me doing this. Just based on the experience I had with one LA restaurant, I don't want that to happen again. The, it was one of the partners got back with me the very day that I sent the email, excited about me doing this hamburger, and, and that means a lot. Kind of shared some minor things, no secrets or anything, but they're excited about seeing my video. So I hope I did it justice. Uh, definitely want to go check out Shoops one of these days. I'll have a link down below again, Illinois, Indiana, it's a classic. It's been there since 1948. It's definitely on my bucket list. Thank you guys for the suggestions. Thanks for stopping by. See you in the next video. Cheers.